Hello everyone and welcome to our Let's Play series of Fallout 1. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today here in uh, Decker's... Is it, was it Decker's? Decker's place? Was he, was he Decker? Yeah, he was Decker. Yes, last episode we killed basically the underground of the town, except for the little guy called Loxley that uh, we didn't kill. But uh, now we're gonna go back, gonna go back to the cops and uh, we're gonna tell them um, that, uh, you know, we're gonna say hi. And hopefully they will actually abort it. Oh, come on. Come on, dog meat. Uh, yeah, and we're going to tell him that everything is good. Did I get this guy? I did. Okay. Uh, and they're going to give us the money. And we'll be out. Who's, who's in there? Nobody's in there, right? No, nobody's in there. We've gotten everything that we can out of that. So let's just go ahead and uh, leave town. Because even though we still have one thing to do here, which is to kill the Death Claw. Um, I, I'm not gonna do it. Not right now. So let's say, say hi to, uh, Justin Green over here. Man, that was one hell of a battle. You did well in there. Now that Decker and Kane are gone, the rest of the underground will fall very shortly. Without leadership, organizations like that can't last. Nobody around here is smart enough to take up the reins. Uh, well, here's the rest of your reward. Thanks again for your help. The city owes you a debt of gratitude. And he hands you... A thousand caps. Thank you very much. And also, I have a lot of stuff on me. A lot, a lot of stuff. And I don't think I'm going to be able to sell it all right now. So what we will do... Well, we will take a... Well, actually, why well, was, I was... I'm saying rubbish. I'm saying rubbish right now. I... There's still things to do here. We still need to go to the south. We haven't explored everything to the south. But first, let me just come over here. Uh, and let me see what he's got. If he has the money... No, he doesn't have the money. Oh boy, but I do want that. I want that so much, but that's so expensive! 65,000, holy crap, holy crap, each time, each time I look at that. Oh, that, that would allow us to get the Death Claw. I can assure you of that. That would protect us enough so that the Death Claw would be, uh, defeatable. Uh, but in for unfortunately, that's not gonna be the case today. So, let's go to the south. Let's, uh, talk to the guys at the Water Merchants, I think that's the name. Of the company that uh, that's down there, it's this way. Uh, that's in here at the merchants' quarter or something like that. We t took care of the children of the cathedral already. We got the water merchants over here, and I think there's also another place over here that is not actually part of the water merchants. Let me just see. There's nobody around, so let's just go around and and, uh, and see if we can get our hands on some good stuff, which is highly unlikely, mind you, because all these things are are empty, usually empty. But, uh, well, at least we'll check. Uh, but I don't think... Maybe we should wait for a little bit. Just to let people come come from their house. Let's, let's wait a little bit. We have time. Let's wait until the morning, which is not actually the morning. And then after that, we wait two hours. Uh, and I lost damage resistance. And I gained intelligence. So that's good. <laughs> because we took Psycho, psycho last episode. Yep. Uh, hey, guy. What? I was gonna call him little guy. It's not It's not a good idea. If you're looking for a job at one of the caravans, you should talk to the master merchant. She's in that building to the east. Yeah, I know. I know. I will go there. Because these guys, they own all the water. What does it say? The, a large water tank looks well maintained, which is probably a good thing. Because, yeah, what about this one? You can't see these things. This thing down here. Can't see that. Hmm. Okay. Let's go in here. Because that is where nobody is, actually. Hmm. That's her. No. No, 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 that's not her. That's her right there. The master merchant. And we need to go there. I'm not actually gonna ask them to um, to send water to the vaults, because we don't need that. We have enough time. It's not gonna be a problem. But if we could, I think it changes two things. Basically, there are two loose cri cri criteria uh, for this game. There's the water l loss screen, where if you let the time go by, basically, they all start. They don't starve. They basically... What's the word for... Uh, for being thirsty and dying of thirst. They die of thirst, basically. That's what they do. Um, but uh, if you, if you, even if you do that, if you, even if you fix the water ship or get the water ship back, uh, you'll, you'll still have another win criteria that is secret. And this one will trade one for the other. So it gives you a hundred more days over here, or fifty more days, and it will take a hundred more days or fifty more days. Uh, it will take away from the other loose criteria, and that actually wins. Uh, basically. Uh, results in a net, you know, it's not a net loss or anything, it's just the same thing that you get, but uh, it still 
it's still not ne really necessary because we have enough time. Let me just save the game here and uh, let's have a chat with them. These guys are all very ready for me to come in here and busting heads. These caravan kind of strips are getting too dangerous. Well, I kind of am interested in doing one of those because we need to go to a... maybe Adatum? Adatum would be a good thing. Let's see. I don't care what they say. We need new parts. Oh yes, yeah, sorry. What can I do for you? Uh, do we have a water chip? Water chip? Hmm. Oh, those old vault purifying control chips? Well, I'm sure I speak for the entire town when I say you won't find one here. Without the proper equipment, they are worthless. Only a vault or maybe necropolis would have any one, any use for one. Why do you ask? Uh, necropolis? Why, why would they need one? Well, it's just... You know, just a guess, really. We tried to start a caravan route to Metropolis once, but they refused to trade with us. Nobody in their right mind refuses water these days unless they have a reliable supply. I figured they must have their own purifier or they would have died out a long time ago. So are you looking to have us go up to your vault? Uh, no, no thanks. It's fine. No, then I'm sorry. I don't think I can help. Okay. Yeah, then you can say yes and you can have her, uh, have her, um, go send water up to your vault. That's as simple as it gets. I want a job. Oh, sure, great, you're hired. Wait, what position? Oh, caravan guard, right? Yeah, sure. Uh, you can work for us. You look okay. And that's that? Okay. So who's the caravan master? I thought there was a person around here that would be the caravan master. Maybe it's her? She's an employee, I guess, but... These guys are guards. She needs a bath, apparently. Her words, not me. Not mine. Yeah, these caravan strips are getting too dangerous, he says again. Man, he's really fixated on that. Hmm... I, I should take a hint, shouldn't I? I should take a hint, but who is the caravan ma how do I how do I do that? What what is that? I don't usually do caravan runs because they're kind of they're not pointless, but it's just that it doesn't it doesn't really it's not worth it's not worth it. I mean, this game is not about the loot and you're not going to get game-changing loot in the in the caravan runs, so it's not a problem. Fallout 2 changes things a little bit, but not by too much of a margin, so it's kind of yeah, it's, it's okay. Uh, excuse me, ma'am, please put your weapon. Oh, I'm sorry. Can I Put my weapon away. There she is. Uh, I want to buy something. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. what happened? What happened? Let's get down to business. Oh, that's right. You're working for Butch. You get a fifteen percent discount. Well, thank you very much. And she has money, which is fantastic. So I'll take all of that nice money. I will also try to check if she has anything that I want, which is not the case, unfortunately. Let's put all of these in here because they are kind of cheap, and these things are kind of expensive so they'll they'll be there hmm how about I put this one instead hmm is that better I think it is uh, and all the rest I could use I should use the scroll wheel for this I am just not used to that you know it's it's a lifetime of not using the scroll wheel in this game there it is and then because he didn't support that back then there were no scroll wheels back then actually uh, thanks Okay, so that's good enough, which means that we're done for now. So, caravan runs. I'm not, again, I'm not 100% sure where it would be. Oh, I mean, oh, we could take we could take the Fargo Traders. No, actually, the Red Caravan. Not What am I saying? The Red Caravan. That's right, let's take... Oh, we haven't been in there? Oh, what are we missing? We haven't been in there. What is... What am I doing? Man, anyway. Well, fortunately, we didn't miss that. So let's go in here and have a chat with these nice, nice people. Hey there, how are you doing? Name's Demetri, Demetri Romara, head uh, of the best damn caravan the wastes. Are you looking for a job? You look pretty strong. Uh, yeah, so? Uh, that's just what we're looking for. You like the thrill and excitement of battle, don't you? Bullets flying everywhere, whipping by your head, blowing your enemy in two, seeing the fear in their eyes, ha, ah, that's the life. You look like the kind of person that could serve as well, and we pay well. Oh, yes we do. We have just had a few new openings, if you're interested. But of course, you are, right? Uh, yeah, what, what, what's the pay? We pay 600 bucks a job. That's each way. Hell, people say we take all the dangerous routes, but I say they're most exciting. You need a little excitement in your life, am I right? Of course I am. Mm-hmm. He also, he also sounds a little bit drunk because he had a hiccup, but he's drunk now. Uh, <laughs> dangerous. Uh, of course it's dangerous. Why else would I fork out 600 bucks? Well, okay. Uh, I'll still take the job. Of course you will. Go talk to Carrie in the next room. She works the scha the schedules or the schedules or however you want to pronounce that. I don't I don't know. I'm drunk. As I said before, I'm not paid to talk, he says. Well, you just did. So, ooh. Well, thank you very much, sir. You're not paid to guard your stuff either. So, actually let me check these ice chest. 
doesn't have anything. That was nice. What did I get out of that? A bunch of drugs is what I got. And that's Carrie over there. Carrie is one of your joinable companions, if I remember correctly, which means that we can bring her along. And she's actually pretty great. Uh, not as great as Tycho, in my experience, but she's pretty great. Uh, she's a little bit crazy. Unless I'm mistaken. Carrie? Oh, so that old bastard gave you the okay to work for us, eh? Well, you must be one tough bitch. I'm impressed, but we'll see how you do. We leave only twice a month, on the 3rd and 17th. Can you handle that? We go to all local hotspots, the Brotherhood, Junktown, Acropolis, and the LA Boneyard. And the pay? Oh, our pay's the best. 600 scripts. Ah, yes, that is that is for each way, but you don't have to do both. This is a pretty tough caravan ride, and you're almost guaranteed to run into some raiders. Or worse, we'll have no CCs on my caravans, and you better have plenty of ammo. We leave on the February the 3rd. Are you interested? Uh, maybe. Whatever. If you get uh, the urge for some action, come back and I'll hook you up on the next caravan out. Okay, so first I need to check the time. Oh, it's quite close. That's fantastic. That is really good. I, I thought it was earlier, but it's not. Man, the time passes by fast. Uh, so, sure. Let's go with that. Cool! The next one's going out on February the 3rd. Come back then and I'll put you on a caravan. As always, it pays 600. Okay. Uh, that's about that. So we need to wait a little bit. Uh, and I think she'll be here by tomorrow. So let's wait until midnight. And that is that. It's technically the 3rd of February. So she should check. Ready to go? We're leaving today. Yup. Good. Like I said before, we pay 600 scripts. Which route do you want to take? Uh, Necropolis? That'll be a nice one. I think so. We're gonna have some fun there. Although, the Boneyard would be pretty good. I mean, we only have, really, at this point, we only have Necropolis and the Boneyard to go. But I think I can go to Necropolis and then take a route south. Or I could take the caravan back over here and then go south from here. We'll see. We'll see. The money's not really that important. The experience is a little bit better. Uh, but let's go to Necropolis then, because apparently we have a lead that goes there in regards to the water chip. I wasn't ready for that lead right now. I had forgotten about it, uh, to be honest. But uh, since we're role-playing, we'll do that. Great! The other psychopaths are ready. We'll leave right away in the middle of the night. Okay. Your fucking history, pal! Says... A raider. They're ghouls, but it makes sense. And you'll know why it makes sense. You'll know, or you know already. Let me uh, just pick up my weapon and punch you. Eh, uh, he says. Oh, they have the, the same... They don't sound like ghouls. Or mutants, as we know them. Because the only one of these that we found, we found already was... Uh, oh, yeah, he's, he's kind of... Dog meat is kind of not in a good position in life. Poor guy. If I get if I get a med kit, I will get you. I'll get the med kit. It's not a med kit, it's a medic bag or something. A doctor's bag or something like that. Uh, so are you ready? Is that all? Man, this... I was promised action. You gave me two goals. Mind your own business, would ya? Actually, no. I... I need to get out of here, sir. Hmm. Is Do we just leave the area? What the hell? <laughs> you guys see what is happening? <laughs> there it is. Care to tell me why you abandoned the fa- Oh, no, 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 no. Care you to shut up. Care you to shut up. Hmm? Care you? Care you? Did I say care you? Oh, boy. Uh, let's see. End of pay. Sure. Okay. And then let's wait until midnight and do the same exact thing we did before. And hopefully now they will not freak out because I'm not really sure what that was all about. Let's go to Necropolis and see if we get a little... Some oh, we do get something better. Okay. Um, what do we have? Some goons. That's okay. Let's try to get you over there. That was critically missed and lost his next turn. Well, he's dead. Oh, I prefer the ghouls. And he fired a dead shot. Oh, he shot dog meat instead of me. Oh, boy. That's what you get. That's what you get. That's what you get. Why can't I... That... Ooh, nice. Okay, now I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, caravan running. It doesn't always go well. And dog meat is broken as well. Literally broken. His leg is, anyway. Uh, and the pay, sure, okay. 
And let me see if I can fix the little mutt. So he's inert but has crippled limbs. And I can't fix that because I don't have a doctor's bag, as I said before. Uh, and I don't know how else I would fix that, so I need to get some. Which means that if we go back to Junk Town, that'd be a good thing. So what I'll do right now is I'll just uh, wait again, but I will take Steam Packs. Which was my biggest problem before, of course. Uh, I'll also equip this thing so I'm a little bit readier than I was before. So I'll take a few Steam Packs over here. Uh, let's see, we need to go up to 64 or 48, and that's 64 right there. We did a decent roll. Let's get the quick save right there, and let's go to Necropolis. Yep, let's go. Necropolis it is. Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, we got the same one as before. Now, let's hope... So, yeah, basically, we're, we're even. The game is even. Or we are even. Something. That's your death. Yep. Dog meat is off. That guy's dodging. Of course, I'm taking shots. I wasn't expecting any other thing. Critically hit for four points. And you're going down, sir. Uh-huh. Oh. Misclick. There it is. And down it goes. Are we done? It should trigger. Unless. You know what happened? You know what I think what I think it is? I think there's more of them around. And I just didn't see them. Because by the looks of it, then. Yeah. There's none of them around. This is bugged. I don't remember this being bugged, but it is. Unless these guys say something different. Or maybe I need to do something here with the caravan or something or other? No. Yeah. It's just what it is. I have no idea what's going on. I just, I have no idea. So we're going to need to do what we did before. It's a shame. They're going to be pissed, but I think they're going to pay the money uh, as well or something. At least it, it's fast. It's the fast way to get there. Can't you tell me why I abandoned the fucking caravan? I can't believe it. Looking for you. They finished without your... Sorry, yes. Get out. I'm not paying you anything. Okay. So, yeah, it's not for the money, really. It's for the, the time it takes, although, yeah, sure, whatever. We got to see that. And then we have these guys. Let's not mess around with them. A zombie ghoul. The body of the humanoid looks to be highly irradiated, and much of the muscle and brain matter have deteriorated. However, genetic indicators lead you to believe that it is descend it descended, like you, from those that entered the vaults. Yeah. These ghouls, they have a specific origin, unlike Harold, apparently, because Harold was turned into a ghoul in in uh, the, what did he call it, the origin, I guess, or, yeah, they're groaning. If you get too close, they'll attack you, so I'm trying not to do that. What I'm trying to do is basically trying to avoid them, because there's no real point in, uh, in, uh, in killing them. There's a little bit of experience in it. I think that's 25 points, but it's a pain in the ass to do it, so it's, it might as well not do it. Uh, and there's uh, actually a few, a few areas here to Metropolis. We're in the hotel area. I think that guy says something. Or maybe he doesn't. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? Nope. Don't mess with my stuff. Ouch. I don't want to mess with your stuff. I just want to... Oh, you don't let me mess with your stuff. Oh, though, yeah. Okay, I just wanted to see if there was anything. So no, 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 don't quit, don't quit, just uh, load. Oh, <gasps> I saved on top. Okay, bye. Not a problem. Nobody's gonna attack you, sir. It's not a problem. Really isn't a problem. Because he's, he's pretty slow. And nobody's gonna attack. Okay, we're good, we're good. I tried to steal from that guy. And everybody's now aggroed on me. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> I can't believe this. Are they all uh, aggroed on me? I it, I just was trying... There's just two of them. Uh, the other ones might not be seeing me, though. That's why I'm asking if they are... I don't I don't actually know where the exit is. Where's the... Uh, there, there it is. Okay, so once we get down there, we might be able to go to the other areas where I need to go. Of course, dog meat is nowhere to be found, but it's going to be all right. It's going to be all right. The first time... I remember the first time I came here. Of course... Oh... Okay, so they're shooting guys. He's missing, and his weapon was destroyed. That's what you get for shooting my friends. Okay, let's get out of here. It's all gonna be fine. So, this is an Acropolis. Very pretty. It's got a uh, huge statue over there. Hotel of Doom. Hotel of Doom. Okay, can you guys go on without me? Can I t t tell you to go on without Because you're totally useless. We're heading back to the hub. Well, then go. 
I don't want you here. Mm, this is a motel. It's not a hotel. It's a motel. Can I get... Oh, I thought... There's two exit areas. Okay. So, we have... I think we have two ways to go. We have. A, don't we have an access point up there? I really don't want to mess with these guys. Oh, there's steam packs. Like, oh, no! Damn it. I, I want to get back there. That's the guy. No, that's not. Okay, he's not he's not mad at me or anything. Good. So these are right away. Pretty good stuff. I should use should have used the sneak. Is he coming? Or is he the slow ones? Because they're slow ones that don't really go too fast. Yeah. Okay, doesn't have anything. Let's go. Yeah, they're slow. They're really slow. The other one was not. The other one talked. <laughs> So I, I really don't want to kill these guys because they're 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 aggressive, but I know I know they're they don't mean it. Okay, so as you can see, they can only walk one. I imagine their punches take one action point, otherwise they wouldn't even uh, be able to attack because they can attack, or maybe they have a special. Yeah, there seems to be a large amount of food traffic in the area, possibly leading to the manhole cover. Yeah, you can actually click the outside and just go down without actually opening the manhole manhole cover. And here we are, in the sewers, which is definitely going to be populated with better things than upstairs. Definitely, definitely. I mean, it's, it's it's always the case, right? It's always the case. Oh, oh, mole rats, my favorite. Huge mole rats, my favorite, favorite. Okay, let's fall back a little bit. Dog meat is not going to be a problem. These things, what are they called? They are greater mole rats, not huge mole rats. What is this? An MMO or something? I don't know what the naming, naming, uh, what's the naming, uh, schemes, schemes, that's the word, R for MMOs, don't, okay, that was a dropped weapon right there, it's okay, I can fix the rest over here, I got another one just in case this guy is in, on top of my weapon and he is not, which is really great, so get that one and put that over there, a little bit of experience, hello guys, how's it going, oh, nice attack right there, so we're just clearing out the dun the sewers, and we got a dead ghoul over there. So these guys seem to have uh, a peculiar appetite for rotting meat, it would seem, because they are rotting. It it's just the mutation. It, it allows them to survive the decay of their own body. I think that's how it goes. It doesn't transform them into a ooh, a cattle broad. That's actually really good because of this. These small energy cells, they will come in handy. We're going to need those a lot, a lot. But for right now, I'm going to save the game, and this time I'm not going to misclick. Yeah, it's it's easy to, um, especially if you're not looking at the keyboard. Hello! I didn't mean to... Um, These guys are going to shoot you. Maybe not. Well, Doc Meat is having none of this. Well, Caravaneer was hit instead of Caravan Customer. What?! How the hell does that work? Who are they shooting? Oh my god. Oh boy. Anyway, let, let them shoot. Let, let me do their shenanigans. Let, let, let's see where this goes. There's something else over there. Oh, hi. No, I'm a friend. I swear. He's not going to attack me, though, because he doesn't have an, an extra turn. And off goes dog meat. Very hastily for some for a dog that, that has a broken leg. And there's piles of dead bodies over here. Dead bodies. It's what it says. It's what it says right there. So what exactly is going on for these guys to to be hmm all dead? Well, let's go up here and see. Wait, don't shoot! I don't have a gun. I say I don't have a gun. He says just wait, don't shoot. Who are you? Is he a nervous ghoul with an air of authority? <sighs> Thank you for not shooting first. Can I help you with anything? Uh sure, who are you? I am the leader of a simple people who have left the surface because of the others. The... what? Who was... who forced you down here? The surface of Necropolis and the water is controlled by Set and his ghouls. We are a much more peaceful group, which disgusts Set. Oh. You... Who is this, this Set? Set is a ghoul like us, but has assu assumed a certain amount of power in the above-ground world. He is an oaf. An oaf, huh? He sounds a lot more interesting than you freaks, but... No, let's not say that. Why does he let you survive down here? Well, he does not speak of it, however. Set is afraid of not having enough people to defend Necropolis if it ever needed it. So he gives us what water we need. Oh. I need water for my people. If you know where he gets it from, tell me now. Well, 
Since our, pops, uh, our pump stopped working, we have been getting our water from a place under the ground. I've heard that a water computer is being used to purif purify the water. Where is that? The watershed is in the north. You'll need to take the sewers to get there. Thanks! Uh, you weren't thinking of take, taking the water chip from us, are you? Uh, you know, of course. W but why? Well, if you take the water chip from us, then we will all die. With our water pump broken, we need it to survive. Is it possible that your pump could be, could be fixed? Well, that may be difficult. The parts needed to fix the pump were lost in the sewers under the watershed. Why is that so difficult? Well, the sewers there are filled with monsters. And none of my people are th that I have sent to retrieve them have come back. Are you willing to retrieve the parts so that the water pump can be fixed? Well, I... Yeah. Well, thank you. <laughs> when you get the parts, return here. It is possible that I can help you further. Okay, I'll be on my way then. Okay, and we know now how to get a water chip. We need to help these guys fix their pump, and then, hopefully, we'll get the water chip. Let's see if these guys say anything. Who's What's his name, by the way? That's a nervous ghoul with an air of authority. He doesn't actually have a name. I wonder if he does, actually, because he probably... On the ground leader. Okay, he doesn't have a name. Uh, No, not yet. I haven't done it. Yeah, I'll see you, I'll see you in a little bit, maybe. Ooh, we have guards over here. Do they have weapons? Hey, guys. I can talk now. I'm watching out for danger. Yeah, you watch out, pal. You watch out. And actually, these stairs, or these ladders, will take us to a different area. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, this is not great. This is not a good... Well, it is great, but it's not a good... A good ladder to come out of. Uh, and I also, I don't I don't know if these guys... Are, no, they're all going to be very aggressive. But the problem is, I don't know if uh, the guys that we want to talk to... That's that's the oath that we read about, set. We're going to want to talk to the guy. Um, if only to see if he's an oath indeed. Nice. That's our first one right there, isn't it? It's got to be, because otherwise it would it would stack. It does not, so we have... Oh, nice. I knew there was something important over here. We're not gonna, I'm not going to talk to those guys. I'm going to do it off camera just to make sure that everything is right. Uh, and if not, then I'm going to need to fix the problem that I did. These guys might be very upset by the fact that, try, that I tried to open a drawer twice in a row, and they, they're like, I, I really wanted to see their panties! I wondered what they look like. They gotta be... Oh, there's rats over there. I'm gonna kill those rats. Um, but up here, that's the watershed. That's the direction to the watershed. And that's where the monsters lie. But for right now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Fallout 1. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, and you want to see more episodes come out sooner, be sure to leave a like down below, leave a comment as well, if you have anything to say about this this particular area. For me, the one with the best soundtrack of the whole game, for sure, and I think the developers agree, because this is the same soundtrack that you ha hear, I think it is, that you hear in the opening movie, in the opening uh, cinematic. Not the maybe one, the one after that. The one that we heard at the beginning of the Let's Play. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.